Australia. And I'm Marshall. Uh, welcome to the Lou Hive uh, Creative Workspace. We're going to teach you a little bit about basic improv. Yeah, um, so one of the first things you need to do uh, when you're learning improv is to make sure that you're accepting offers. So things like uh, if I wanted to say, hey look over there, there's an elephant over there. Oh my goodness, it's enormous. I didn't expect you to have one in your backyard. I know, right? Yeah, it's a safari. You know, bring back from the when I was on safari last. So, so the idea, the idea behind this is that you are uh, giving offers, so uh, suggesting that something might be what something is, mm. uh, and the other person needs to uh, accept your idea and add to it as well, uh, and then hopefully working together with accepting offers and, uh, and giving offers, you create little scenes yeah. uh, supporting each other. You build up a bit of a story, and uh, it, it kind of takes place and can be a lot of fun. We get to use our imaginations and uh, yeah, have a bit of fun just making things up as we go. So what we're going to do to uh, demonstrate uh, this in a simple form, uh, I'm going to give Marshall an offer of a gift. And the way that I do that is I'll pick something up, I'll experience the weight of this thing, the size of this thing, and uh, this in itself is an offer because it's showing Marshall what I experienced this object to be. So, uh, for example, I will pick up this object, I'll give it to Marshall and he'll thank me for the gift and tell us what the gift is. Wow, yeah, thanks. This is one of the best uh, cheese boards I've ever seen. It's exactly what I've needed, so. Uh, yeah, I noticed you there. love cheese. I uh, do. I thought you could, you know, go to the market to pick up some of your favorites. We'll have a bit of a cheese party. Yeah. So, so there you go. That, that's just a, a basic example of an offer. It's a bit, got a bit of physicality. Now, if I had picked up an object which is this small, and Marshall says, oh, thanks for the real elephant, uh, this might be an example of blocking. I picked up something which is clearly not an elephant because it's very small, and he said, thank you for the elephant, which is negating the offer I have given him. stuck thinking well I said that it was a goldfish bowl and now you're telling me it's a, a golden nugget and everyone gets a little bit confused what's going on there so it's much easier to uh, keep it to, simple to go with that exactly. go with it. All right. that's uh, a little bit about the basics here